Hello everyone and welcome back to chapter 7, Word Stress. Uh, this next activity is a discussion activity. And I just want you guys to take the opportunity to share with one another, regardless of your first language, I think we all share this in common, that there are certain words that we mispronounce. And oftentimes when we mispronounce words, it could be the, the consonant sound, you know, maybe we're getting P and B confused or D and T confused with one another, M and N, or perhaps a vowel sound. So these are common mistakes with pronunciation, but I think a common mistake with pronunciation that impedes our ability to be understood is this idea of uh, mispronouncing word stress. Forgive me, and that's what they talk about here on page 49. Uh, when word stress is wrong, and what do we mean by word stress? We mean the, the strong syllable, the syllable where the vowel sound is pronounced stronger, more clearly. So when we, when we have incorrect word stress, the person that you're speaking with might not understand you, uh, and maybe sometimes they might even correct you if you stress the wrong syllable. For example, dessert, second syllable is different from, but sounds similar to desert. Desert, desert. Uh, if you stress all syllables in specialty, then it might sound like specialty <laughs> instead of specialty. When the first syllable is pronounced the strongest there. So what I want you to do for this activity is just share. Share your experiences of maybe where you may have made a mistake in word stress. Have you ever had a conversation with someone asked you to repeat the word, a particular word, over and over again. Can you say that again? I didn't quite catch that. And then after you do that, they say, oh, you mean blank. I thought you said blank, <laughs> right? They get two words mixed up. Perhaps maybe it was a mistake in word stress. Share that experience of maybe when you had incorrect word stress where you, you focused on the wrong syllable to give stress. So share a recent experience where you may have made that mistake and then include the following information in your post. Where were you? Where did this happen? Was this at work? At, at school? Your, your child's school? At the doctor's office? Shopping? Um, with your neighbor? What have you? Who were you talking with? What was it that you were trying to say? And then how did you and that person react? Did you laugh? Was it frustrating? Um, share a little bit of the experience with everyone. You can do a video post where you can type uh, your responses to these to give that experience, share that experience. And then as we always do, please respond to three classmates and you are doing a wonderful job of this, everyone. I really appreciate it. Uh, great conversation that you guys are having, and that's what this is. It's a discussion, a conversation. So please reply to at least three classmates. Share something that you have in common. Maybe it's the same word that you also mispronounced, or maybe it's a similar situation, uh, setting, or a person that you were talking with, or maybe you laughed too, uh, and the other person laughed about it as well. So I look forward to your responses to this conversation.